Hey everyone, Sweet Johnny Cage here, back with another guide for Crash 4. This time we're going to take you through the inverted version of Cortex Castle. Same rules apply here, you just want to keep phasing things in and out, in and out. And we're going to jump up to this first checkpoint while phasing out the platform. We're going to hit that, and then we want to phase these platforms. We can just do a sliding double jump over here. We're going to ride this up to an optional box. So once this hits the top, just do a crouching double jump, phase out the nitro, grab the one up, and come back down. Okay. So once you're here, phase out the lasers, jump to safety. We're going to break this flame box. Phase to get the one up. Bounce over here. Don't forget about the one box up here, just like I did. Phase out the lasers, jump, and then phase out the next set of lasers here. Great. Hitting this checkpoint, we should have 14 boxes. Picking up the time mask. You want to slow things down to avoid the saw blades. There's a jet board enemy here, so be sure to just kill him real quick. You want to slow things down. There is still a one-up box just under the chandelier in this room. So we should grab that. Wait for this flame box. Break it. Slow down time. Use the nitro as a bounce box. It explodes. We're going to slow down time to ride these saw blades all the way up here. There's two jet board enemies in the next room, so be sure to slow down time to avoid them. Okay, then once the buzzsaw bounces on the first wall, we're going to use it as a platform, just like that. And then we're going to head over here, and we're going to break these boxes and get ready for the bonus. Somehow my belly flop was not large enough to break everything. Okay, so heading into the bonus, we should have 25 crates. And this is a tough bonus. You can die as many times as you like. It will not infect, it will not affect your insanely perfect run. Okay, so once you are over here, slow down time, bounce on these. Slow it down one more time, bounce up here to get the one up. That'll hit the switch, slide over to safety. Slow down time, drop down here and then tuck yourself into the little alcove. Slow down time, touch one of the nitros. Once the robot shoots an orb, slow down time, break these boxes, break that one box, jump on these boxes. Hit this switch, come over here, and then you want to slow down time, slide over here, belly flop onto these boxes to break them, hit the switch, and then we're gonna jump, slow down time, bounce on all these nitro, come over here to safety, spin everything away, and that's all 39 crates. Should have 64 crates leaving the bonus, and very close to your second Wumpa Fruit gem. Okay, so now we're gonna make our way over to the hidden gem, which is very high up in this next section. Let's jump over here, you can see it up there if you look carefully. So we're gonna hit this checkpoint, and we're gonna grab a Kano. But we gotta be very careful not to lose him. So you want to jump up here, trigger these, and then you want to do a jump spin up to this little alcove to get the hidden gem. All right, so once you do that, you can cross this totally safely without that TNT. Bonk this knight twice to knock him off. Okay, break these boxes, jump over here. Don't forget to wait out the flame box if you need, then you can break that and trigger the TNT. Akano jump over, there's another knight. Just gotta bonk him once, great. Break these four crates, and then we're going to trigger one of the TNTs below. Okay. Jump up here. Trigger one of these. Again, be very careful. When you're over here, you want to do a sliding double jump onto this TNT. Do not break the first box. If you do, this will become a lot harder. All right. Now break the first box. Come over. Do a long double jump over to safety. You should have 94 crate. Okay. Spin these boxes away. Drop down. Spin these. Then you can trigger these right here. Belly flop onto this box. And then once you're ready to get funky with gravity, ride this platform up. Do a double flip there. Break these two boxes. And then once the platform gets almost out of view, you can flip up here. Don't forget to trigger these two TNT right here. Break these. And then you can start breaking this stack here. Okay, you can slide under to break this box instead of losing it. Trigger the TNT, then do a quick flip and another flip to land on this little machine here. Follow these saw blades, we're gonna take this safely. So just duck, then we're gonna jump, flip, and flip. Duck again, we're gonna flip and flip, duck again. Then we're gonna do a long jump, flip and flip, and then duck again. Great. So, we're gonna see the event from the next level, which at this point we know is seeing double. Okay, once that's done, Head to the next checkpoint, and then it's time to get crazy with some masks. Alright, so break these four crates up here before moving too much further. 
All right, trigger one of the TNTs. Hit the checkpoint, and we should have 131 crates. What we're going to do is we're going to phase in the platform, and then once it's close to us, we're going to jump on it. Ride it a little ways up, and just before we get clipped by the lasers, we're going to do a sliding jump to get a Kano. Activate him, jump over to the time mask, activate that. Come over here, grab the gravity mask, quickly do a double flip to the next checkpoint. Jump and grab a Kano, but then go back to safety. It's easier to do it this way. Hit these TNTs, do an Econo jump, get the time mask, slow down time, hit these two. As soon as you get the gravity mask, hit it. As soon as you grab Lonnie Lonely, hit it again. And we're going to sliding double jump over here. We still need to ride this laser grid back because it holds a lone box that we will not be able to get to otherwise. Okay, over here, break that, great. Hit the next checkpoint, grab Lonnie Lowly. Take a breather, wipe your hands in case you need. Phase out the lasers. Phase them back in to get the platform. Jump, phase them out, phase them back in. And then wait for this robot. Follow these fruit down. You don't even need to use uh, Econo if you don't want. Activate all these TNT. Try to get as far away from the explosion as possible. And then just ride the platform. Do a crouching double jump to get the time mask. Slow down time once the boxes are in a good position for you. Okay. Wait for this platform to move. Follow the trail, grab gravity, hit it as soon as you get it, hit time as soon as you get it, and then you can wait as long as you need right here. Once you're ready, slow down time again, slide, grab a Kano, hit this platform, jump, phase, jump, switch gravity twice, and hit the nitro switch, and you're done. It's a really tough section. Basically, the gist of it is, as soon as you grab a mask in that final section, just press R2 to use it, and hold left, and you will get where you need to go. But once you get the gravity mask, you need to wait a second before you hit R2 a second time. This way you don't get clipped by any lasers. But that's it. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment. I'll do my best to help you out. If you're looking for more guides for Crash 4, please subscribe to the channel so you get alerted when new guides go live. If you're interested in supporting the channel monetarily, please consider becoming a channel member by clicking the blue join button below this video. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter and on Twitch. And as always, I'll be Johnny Cage. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.